Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm in traffic on my way to um, my third Dollar Tree this week. It's really bright out, so I got my sunglasses on. Let's see if I can turn this around for you. Well, there it is. I'm going to check it out. It's been a bit since I've been in there. This one's pretty big, and they, they've had some things, as all Dollar Trees do, that I haven't seen in other places. So we're going to see what it is that they have here. I'm hoping I find my snowflake plates and maybe a few other treasures. Be exciting to see. pounding but alas it's just the bowls and the tis the season plates these are adorable love them these feel supposed to be satin but they're very stiff and kind of plasticky but really nice table runners and they have them in the red white and green very nice Once again, the um, wrapping paper is available in great abundance. This is really cute. It houses on I don't think I've seen that one before. Or the cardinal. Look how cute that is. This one seems to have some papers I haven't seen before. That's good. Wrapping paper. Here's another. These are adorable. Oh, Christmas vacation. That is cute. It was looking to me like it had... I've seen that one. Ho, ho, ho. This is the Hallmark Expressions. Vintage Santa. I love this. This is also Hallmark Expressions. It's got the snowman on it. Very nice. I may have to grab some of these. Christmas. Of course, the red and the white. Very pretty gift wrap here. Hallmark Expressions with the cookies and the pastel. Very cute. I love it. You can see some of the other. Completely loaded. Oh, that's cute. The peppermint candies. Here are the gift tags. These are cute. 100. Oh my gosh. They look like cookies on a cookie sheet. That's cute. They look like they're stickers. This is uh, 52 pieces. So you have these that are stickers and then these up here. These are nice. There's another hundred. Very cute. Light bags. Oh, look at these gift tags. Oh, those are nice. I love it. Eighteen. Any other styles? Vintage Santa. Yeah. 
and the gift bags full. As we've seen everywhere. These cute little gift card holders. Very nice. More gift bags. Check them out. And the gift tissue and the plain white boxes. And then I went through these cards at my day two Dollar Tree. I'll link that below. Twenty-two gift bows for dollar twenty-five. These are the wine bottle bags. Very nice. And then red, this red Christmas cheer, and then gold with the cream. Blue. Oh, I haven't seen this yet. Oh, look at that bag. Very pretty. Good size, too. Look at this one. Very nice. Oh, bags, bags, bags galore. They're putting out more stuff, so I'm not going to rush over there. But you can see they've got gift tissue that's adorable. The gold, and then they have, oh my gosh, do you see that vintage reindeer? on the gift boxes. I hope I can get over there. Here's more of those five gift boxes and some other gift boxes in the red and green paper. I'm not going to tear up what they're doing here because I can see they're putting out more stuff. What's all this? Confetti. Birthday things. I can see more wreaths peeking out there. Haven't seen these before. Joy and be merry and peace. These are nice. There's three there. Oh my gosh, look how cute that is. The sleigh. Christmas wishes. What else do they have? Love it. Those signs are nice. They're huge. And then the believe signs. It's the felt garland. I've seen the Santa one. I haven't seen this one. So that's nice. And then look at these signs. Very pretty. This is metal. It says faith. And this one says hope. It's really good. Of course, the pool noodles for doing Christmas DIYs. Now, I haven't seen this ornament anywhere. It's got a little jingle bell on it. That's beautiful, the little plushy. The cardinals and the doves. I've got two cardinals in my patriotic tree. We have these. Two for a dollar twenty-five. I love these. I've been contemplating picking up the red and blue for my patriotic tree, but I don't know if I need them. I really don't think I do. Um, these I've heard are flying off the handle. Very simple, classic. A little bit of farmhouse. You could personalize these and turn these into a, um, you know, a gift for someone. I love it. These are the metal snowflake ornaments. These go fast. 
I've got six at home and I'm going to be doing a DIY to make some napkin rings. So stay tuned for that. And we're good. Here's the Christmas floral. I might be getting some of this, but not today. And I start decorating my hearth. I'll see what I need. I've got quite a bit on hand, so I may have more than enough, but if not, I'll be coming in to pick up either some berry picks or some of these pine cone bunches. We'll see. I haven't decided yet. As you can see, I love looking at this one. It's well kept. And look how they put the bows up there. I love it. I love it when they take time to make it organized. And you can see the colors are all together. And so any kind of gatherings you're having, birthdays or otherwise, you've got what you need right here. And it's still, I think, a better deal than someplace else. They seem to have more than enough. Oh, and here's my favorites. They're gorgeous. I already got enough of those, but I'm glad they're still stocking them. Makes me feel good. And then here's the plastic you can need to make sure that you're looking. They seem to have a lot of these. You could do individual desserts for the holidays just to make them a little elegant. Look at that. Ready sets. Three ready sets. Napkin, fork, knife, spoon. Party coins. These are the silver plastic cutlery. These are just the forks. Glittered. This would be a good, whether you're thinking of doing them for the, I had to bend down and pick something up. Spoons. Four pack spoons. Servers. I think Dollar Tree really not, knocks it out of the park. There's all the little serving utensils that they do. There's the forks. And here are the plastic forks for the birds and whatnot. Condiment cups. And of course, your little quote unquote disposable wine glasses. Oh, excuse me, that's a different shape. Okay, these are champagne, champagne glasses, so they're a little rounder. And then these here are wine glasses. I like it. And then all the trays, all the things. Deviled egg tray. All of them. These would be cute if you're doing a decorate your own sugar cookie or decorate your own cupcake. Pay attention because uh, these look like they're all the same size. You could put the sprinkles for each child in a cup and seal it and give them one of those along with the cookie and the frosting so you don't have a mess. Just a thought. And then here are the glittery dessert plates or the clear. You get eight for $1.25. No. And then, of course, the 48 forks, spoons, and then the mixture up there. Really good. And then the birthday with all the shred at the bottom. More party. More tissue and gift wrap. They do a great job in this store. I've been really surprised. I've noticed that messy Dollar Trees have really been stepping up their game. Things that I've known in the past to be messy. There seems to be an increase in the standard. Okay. Almost had it. That one I did the other day. Had them in numeric order. One to zero. So they don't seem to have any threes, but... wish. I just, I really enjoy seeing. Come over to this side. These are the paper bags, the ribbons, all the wrapping, and the clear cellophane. 
just these pretty papers. I love it. Coming down the crafting aisle and then the aisle where they have the candles and the home decor. Let's go over here to crafting first. I'm not seeing anything yet that is standing out as being something I haven't seen in any other Dollar Tree. They do have the glue guns, I'm glad to see. They do have some of the vinyl, I'm glad to see, and the planks of wood and yarn. That's great. String and the tube confetti, the storage containers, are great for storing things like the tube confetti or the glitters or the jewels, beads, feathers, great tools, and the canvases, of course, and paints. Glad to see there's little bit of a standardizing of how they arrange things. Maybe not in the same order. Now let me see what they have here. Oh, okay. These are cute. My home, my family, my life. This isn't arranged very well, but very blessed with good friends and great family. Essie Kitchen is a happy kitchen. Okay. Love grows here. Come in, we are awesome. Just some of the fun little canvases they have here. stocked with their ribbon. That's my favorite. They have some more kind of burlap ribbon here that's plain. Those would be beautiful bows. One bow per, per roll. And you've got some beautiful. A lot of these look like they're chiffon. See through. I love that lace. Too. Hedgehogs. Cute. Is that a thing now? Hedgehogs. Maybe for the fall. Very cute. Foxes. Cute woodland. I love it. I've seen these in a couple of other places and didn't highlight them, but I love that there's this on here that you could just write something on it put flowers in it for someone's birthday, write their name on it, or write I love you, or what would you do with that? Hmm? These succulents. Nice picks. All right, we're coming into the toy and book section. Their toy section seems to be a little bit bigger than I've other places I've seen, although their balls look like they need to be restocked. They do have a few. I've seen the smiling bubbles in some places. The naked blocks. 
creative sets. One of the Crayola stuff. I have this actually. This is a cute little, I haven't opened it yet, but it's a hangman magnet. This is a lot of dough for $1.25. This is worth $1.25, and there's molds inside it. Uh, 10 ounces with two cutters. I actually got these for my Wednesday night Bible, uh, children's class that I taught, and I got one of each color. So this was the red, yellow, and I believe they had blue, and I was able to break off, you know, three good-sized chunks, maybe four if I made them a little bit smaller. And uh, there's also, yeah, here's the blue. The color up here at the top is the color of the dough. So you have the yellow, the red, and the blue, and of course you could mix the yellow and red to get orange, and the blue and yellow to get green, and the blue and red to get purple. So if you needed, you know, that's a, that's a good value for $1.25, and it stays it's relatively soft. You would probably have to get a container or a bag to put them in so that it wouldn't um, dry out. Color and fold paper craft set. Oh, that's nice. Fan, heart, crown, flower, butterfly. So it's like an origami set. That's really cute. It's 10 farm animals, yeah. are a little messy, but let me see what I can find here. Okay, they do seem to have a lot of color books. Oh my gosh, Babe Ruff and the Legendary Canines of Sports. Let's uh, see what's in here. This looks precious. The Lamb Bone Leap. Oh my gosh. Well groomed. Troy Poodle Lau. Poodle Malau. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is Chipper Bones, Big Puppy. Oh my gosh. This is too funny. Slopper Griffin the Third. When in doubt, go with a flea flicker. Oh my heavens. Landon Doberman, Sir Rover Bannister. Ugh. That is funny. I wish they'd give a little more attention here because I love the book section. Now see, I couldn't find these anywhere at the other Dollar Trees when I was shopping for my um, Christmas child. Uh, boxes. So I'm not seeing. I'm wondering if they have a book for every letter. Nosy posy. I'd have to look and see if they have the whole set. That'd be something I'd love to get the whole set. Movie Countdown Collection? Is that an advent? It's by Hasbro. Twenty Days of Spidey Surprises. Oh, you could use this as a countdown. And it looks like there's fourteen and four and two. So I guess there's two things to build. I would imagine it's not the same. Um, Get ready for Spider-Man and Miles Morales to hit the big screen with favorite hero and villain figures, stickers, and cardboard builds. So there's four stickers, 14 figures, and two cardboard builds. Wow. That is a great value for $1.25. Where are your, are your um, Spider-Man folks? That's cute. Okay. The Make It Blocks. 
Okay, these are Minion blind bags. I guess that's a good deal for blind bags. Okay. Final Faction. These are, this is a Dollar Tree um, creation. So, but I love that they're doing this, you know, alien kind of thing with the little weapons and you have the action figures. I don't see them here, I just see the monsters and the weapons for the others. These are the boy toys on this side of the aisle. Spin art, that's cute. Anyone ever have that? Comment below. And then the Maisto Fresh Metal. These are metal cars, obviously, in the same line with the um, Hot Wheels and uh, what's the other one? Diecast Cars, three for a dollar. These are cute, as are these. Now, I have bought the confetti Play-Doh because I've never seen it in this size in the stores. But be warned, this is now $1.25 and the regular Play-Doh cans in Walmart are 50 cents. But I've never seen confetti Play-Doh in Walmart. But I did buy them when they were a dollar just because I've never seen them. So. Okay, and then there's the grabber. Those are kind of fun. Now on this side of the aisle, you have, there's the books, you have the puzzles. I saw some new puzzles that I thought were kind of cute. That's Domino's. That's cute. The Lion King Domino's. They have some cute little 24 puzzles. I think I saw a Minnie Mouse puzzle at, at another Dollar Tree I went to. These are the um, and we also have an iron. This cute little horse doesn't seem to be in the right place. And then we have the um, like My Little Pony kind of horses, more of the rag dolls. Look what's here. Tippies. This is Minnie, Mickey Mouse. Minnie Mouse. Vintage Mickey. Tippies. Pluto. Dale. Daisy Duck. Donald Duck. Chip, it looks like. Goofy. Vintage Mickey. And then back here are the Peanuts ones with Sally and Woodstock. Um, Flying Ace Snoopy. There's Linus. Linus was not at the last one I went to. Peppermint Patty. Charlie Brown. Lucy. Joe Cool Snoopy. Regular Snoopy. Oh wait, no, what is that? Nope, it's got a different look. He's smiling. Let's see, there's that one there where he's smiling, eyes closed, and then this one. Those are adorable, great stocking stuffers. And they seem to spin tips and stay standing. <laughs> Tippies, really cute. And it does show you on the back all of the ones that are available for collecting. It looks like we have all of them here. Yep. This box has them all. I didn't see any duplicates. I could literally see what's on the back of these. So, Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Daisy, Pluto, Chip and Dale, Goofy, and it looks like there's uh, two vintage, uh, vintage Mickey, vintage Minnie. I think they had them all in there too. Here's the Disney Sum Sums. This is Marie from Aristocats. Mickey, Minnie, Tigger, Stitch, Piglet, Dumbo. Who? There's still.
Vestige and Eeyore. I think I got the full set for my granddaughter the last time I saw them. These are cute. Perfect for little hands to hold on to. Really cute. The little hot plate with the pot seasoning, the knife and the spatula. Of course, more of this wonderful play food. This stuff's expensive. A buck 25 is still a great deal for those things. I'm not so sure about these things, though. Maybe a dollar twenty-five. I'd have to see. Shoes and accessories, purses. Those were probably a good deal. But we'll see Barbie furniture down there. One of the soft rag dolls, baby dolls. Here's a whole section of nothing but Christmas crafts. We have the color me bags. A little glitter effect, plaster ornaments. These are decorations to add to a stock. So these are cute, and here's different designs. We've seen these in other places. Twelve, either felt or foam. All the ribbon. Look at these. Merry Christmas. And then the DIY bulbs. You could turn these into. Open this up. Fill it with hot cocoa, and marsh miniature marshmallows, and crushed candy canes. Have them hanging on the tree. Tie a ribbon on them. Great gift for your friends that come over. Something I haven't seen before, wall art. These are very cute. I never put these in my window, but they're really excellent to use in your planners or something like that. So if you have the foam scatter, I did a DIY I could link below to show you how I turned this into ornaments using Dollar Tree products. And then there are the little trees. This end cap has like stocking stuffer things, so you have the matchbox cars sets of a hundred pieces of like Legos. These little build it sets. Love it. Checkers. The eight pack of Play-Doh Silly String. And then this, oh, this is a nice wishy ball. I love it. And then the tumbling tower. There's 72 pieces there for a small Jenga. That's a good deal. Excellent. Here's an end cap, really nicely marketed with the popcorn, plus the bags, plus the movies for $1.25. You might find some real treasures in here. I've found some really good old ones, older movies. I don't know about that one. Some of these I've never heard of before. Sneezing Baby Panda. Felix, Eminence Hill. Sometimes I'll get one of these weird ones I've never heard of just because it's got an actor in it that I like. This one has Vivica Fox and Daniel Baldwin. Though it doesn't look like my kind of film. Steam Engineers of Oz. That might be cute. William Shatner, Ron Perlman, Julianne Huff. That might be a really good movie. Nope. Know about that. Just don't overlook it. You might find a real, real good deal. Coming down the body wash, I've got my eye out for the palette 
of face masks. Some of the, a lot of these products are worth a dollar and 25 cents because you pay a lot more than that. Here are the soaps. Some of these, mm, I think Walmart has a better deal, but I'd have to double check that. Fully stocked. All right, I'm gonna go slowly on the cosmetic aisle. Q-tips. Oh, these are cute for little girls. Look at this. The nail polishes. Press-on nails. My granddaughter's a little young for that yet. But I know that she would in a heartbeat. She wants to do makeup all the time. <laughs> this is that sugar coffee body scrub. These are the greatest. They have the cocoa butter. They have the original, sorry, that was my thing. And they also have the rose, which is red. Cute lip balms with hair clips. I'm not seeing any new product. That's a nice palette. We have bronzer and then the nail polish. Cute. I think I have this exact palette at home. I love it. This end cap is all Christmas. I love this. It's the most wonderful time of the year. I have this one. Gnome for the Christmas and have yourself a merry little Christmas. These are nice. Poinsettia is beautiful, that little bit of glitter, and of course the Christmas tree I've had. Is the season. And these little, I haven't seen these canisters. Oh, that would be a nice to put some of those little um, some cookies and candy candies in there. Be so nice. They really do good with those gift canisters. I'm in the hair aisle and I noticed they have a lot of these baby headbands and hair barrettes. Very cute. Darker pink and white. down the dish aisle. I'm not going to get my hopes up, but you never know. They still have some linen and some of the marbleized. Look at this. This would make a nice gift for someone, part of a gift basket. I don't think these with the ridges that you'd have great success personalizing them. You would need something that's got a flat thing to it, but those are nice. I haven't seen this basic plate with the gold rim. It's, I think they have gold and silver. This is really nice if you just want a basic dressed up set. Simple, minimalist. I've seen them in places, and then of course you have the, the wood grain chargers, silver chargers, the gold chargers, and there's two styles. See the small and the large. Make sure you're paying attention to that because you might wind up getting an odd one out. And then all these glass containers, bowls, mugs. This would be cute two of these with a two liter bottle of good root beer or you know a six pack of root beer in the in the glass bottles 
and a coupon for some ice cream, an ice cream scoop, and give somebody like a root beer float gift basket. Whipped cream or whatever it is you would add to it as well. My daughter has an espresso. This would be nice to get her a set of those. And here is the goblets for the other Christmas print. I'm looking, of course, for the snowflake. And they have the water glasses right there. They have plenty of them. And then, of course, you have the tis the season. Or plain. Oops. Or plain. <laughs> Definitely have enough chargers. Good to see. Seem to be fully stocked with calendars, all kinds, including the desk down there. All right, I don't think I've ever seen room mist before. This is ocean breeze and cherry blossom. I don't believe I've seen that before. Right. That's new. Glad to find it. All right, guys, that seems to be everything I could find that's new. I hope you enjoyed this day three of a shop with me at a different Dollar Tree. I didn't find my snowflake plates, but I'm not going to give up. Thanks for spending a little time with me. Bye until next time.